You ever had that moment where, you know, you're trying to show off to your friend your cool PC gaming rig and uh, you also have a very cool RGB light keyboard that you want to show off. They come over and they're looking at it and they're kind of not impressed and you, you feel embarrassed like, wow, wow, I wish I had better keycaps, you know, uh, better keycaps to show off the full potential of the lights and the colors. No, that hasn't happened to you? Anyway. Companies are building keycaps to show off, you know, uh, your RGB keyboard setup. HyperX is one of them, and we're going to be talking about that in this video. Nerd Reactor, roll out. But before we talk about the new HyperX putting keycaps, uh, I want to talk about uh, my Twitch channel, uh, which I'm starting now. I'm starting with Twitch. Uh, recently, I've done it before, but I've been like pretty bad about it. But yeah, you can check it out on the uh, URL right here. Link also in the description. Uh, so I'll usually be streaming Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Just come, let's chat, and uh, let's uh, let's do some video games. And also my other social media channels on uh, Instagram, uh, Twitter, and also Discord. So you go to Discord and check out uh, the uh, server. We, you know, we talk about tech, we can talk about movies, video games, and entertainment. And so without further ado, let's get on with the new keycaps. All right, so yeah, today I get to talk about the uh, new HyperX pudding keycaps. Uh, so yeah, these new pudding keycaps, uh, these are the uh, double shot PBT. PBT is the material, the plastic material that they use that's durable and it won't, uh, you know, it won't be as shiny as fast as compared to the uh, ABS keycaps, uh, ABS plastic. And uh, so with these, this is how it looks like. It's the double shot. And uh, the reason why it's called pudding is because it looks like uh, the pudding dessert with uh, two different layers. And the double shot pretty much uh, the same thing where it's like you put the two different plastics, you meld them together, it creates one. And the cool thing about it is that because uh, you do uh, the two different plastics, like the lettering is made of actual plastic instead of an actual uh, printing on it. So that means this lasts longer and you can keep on typing and you won't have to worry about the letters, the fonts fading away. And so that's what's cool about the, uh, the double shot. Oh, well, yeah, HyperX, uh, they've already released the uh, previous versions of uh, the, uh, the pudding keycaps, but this one, the new version has new fonts it's like the HyperX font and also it's designed to actually shine more bright uh, you know more light compared to the previous ones and with the uh, the font like uh, people have issues with the previous ones where like let's say the O's or the circles uh, they don't really fully connect <laughs> and so this one they fully connect so these are actual letters that you can read or legible like okay that is a zero Oh, uh, that's a Q, and uh, pretty much anything that's like closed with a loop, you just know that's the letter that it is with the new, the new style, the new font, and uh, with these new keycaps. So let's switch out the uh, keycaps with the new pudding keycaps from HyperX. So this is it. This is the keyboard. Uh, very bright. Look at my face. Look at how bright this is. I know it's not as clear as I'm showing on the camera right now, uh, but yeah, these are super, super bright. And you can change. You can change the brightness though. Let's see. There you go. This is this is off. Lowest setting right here. All the way the highest one but with the pudding design uh, I'm really impressed with this one it's the the colors they really shine bright and they're very colorful and not not to the point where it's it's let's say it's like clear super clear glass where it's like just shining straight through it still has enough where it's subtle enough but it's, uh, it's still uh, it just captivates you you're like hypnotized by it uh, so yeah the uh, the keyboard that I'm using right now is the HyperX uh, Alloy Origins Mechanical Keyboard, and uh, I previously had the uh, 
I have the other keycaps, the previous pudding one, but they were uh, all white with the bottom and top layer being white uh, with the bottom layer, you know, showing the colors. But yeah, I wasn't a huge fan of it just because of the, uh, the lettering and uh, yeah, it's like the uh, the white top layer mixed in with my uh, keyboard that's black. They didn't really complement each other, but if you have a white keyboard, that's great. But yeah, with these, even though they recommend like the HyperX mechanical keyboards, you can also use these on other keyboards with the Cherry NX switches. Um, there are like certain keyboards where like, some of the switches won't fit, but you kind of have to like push them in, like let's say the uh, space bar and etc. But with the HyperX uh, mechanical keyboards, you know with the keycaps, they're fully compatible and all the uh, keycaps will fit. Um, but uh, yeah, if you still want to try it on the other ones, you're more welcome to try it. And HyperX, uh, you know, they suggest uh, or they even say like, you know, it's not a guarantee. So it's just, uh, just, just check it out, try it out. And uh, so yeah, let's test out like the typing, the clicking sound. Just feels really nice. I like, I like these keycaps. They're pretty, uh, they're pretty sturdy. Yeah, so with the new uh, pudding keycaps, uh, I definitely like them better than their previous one. Uh, you know, more lights and uh, more colors able to go through, and I like the uh, the fonts. They're actually uh, they're, they're, just, they're just better. They just look they look better. You can actually read them. The circle looks like a circle, and zeros look like zeros. Uh, there is one gripe I have with this. It's the uh, I wish there there were media key symbols or even the color symbols, especially if you have the uh, HyperX mechanical keyboards. Uh, for example, the uh, the one that came stock with the keyboard, you know, it has a different settings. Like this one, like uh, with F2, it messes with your the lighting settings, uh, where you press Fn, and then the uh, other uh, other uh, function F functions, and then you can test them out. And uh, the new ones don't have the media keys, uh, which I do like, like the media shortcuts. You press FN and you know go forward a track, go back a track, or even a quick uh, the volume up and down. So I think I'm gonna switch them out like the top row of the uh, the function keys with the stock ones I have, uh, just because I like I like the little shortcuts uh, images, and hopefully the designs not gonna look that bad. But yeah, uh, so overall you know I definitely enjoy these. They're they're pretty. Uh, so far they feel great and they're they feel durable all right so yeah once again uh i have a twitch channel i'm trying to get more active in it and uh, i'll be doing like uh, weekly videos or weekly streams so i'll be streaming tuesdays thursdays and saturdays and uh yeah so you can check me out there and also on social media and don't forget to uh, hit the uh, subscribe button and like this video if you enjoyed it uh, with that said, I'm John, and I'll see you guys next time.